Hi everyone, this is Lindsay. I wanted to come to you today and give you a quick tip regarding Google My Business verification. Um, it's something that's obviously very important for any business to have, but it can sometimes be difficult to get. Quite often we run into problems with the methods that Google provides us like postcards, just not showing up in the mail seems to be the most frequent issue that we have. And then just not being given an alternative option um, for that verification method. So if that's a problem that you're running into, we'll kind of walk through some steps on how to sidestep that. Um, this is actually a link to our client who is having this exact issue right now. Um, so we have requested postcards for them. I just had to do another one today, but we've actually requested this several times and it's just not showing up. So I've logged into their Google My Business dashboard and I'm gonna go to pending verification and then click on this learn more link. And then I'm going to scroll to the bottom of this page and go to lost or missing verification codes. And then contact us. So the first thing it's going to ask is what you need help with. I'm not receiving my verification postcard. Next step, what's the specific issue regarding the postcard? In this case, the postcard did not arrive. And then on to the next step, you can bypass all these recommended things they have here. And you'll be given contact options. Every now and again, this chat option is available. Um, I haven't actually had the opportunity to try it yet. I'm not sure if that might be an easier way, but for right now it's not available. So we're just gonna go through email, which is typically how I've gone through this in the past. Um, so I'm gonna put my name. I'm gonna put my email. The business name is actually asking for the, the name of the business that I'm trying to get verified. So I'm going to update this to Ladder and Bloom Property Management. Now it's going to ask for the URL on the Maps link for this business. So the way that you get this is you search for your business on Google or directly in Google Maps. And once you see your listing, you click on that. And this is your specific Google Maps link. So you're going to copy this whole long URL up here. And we are going to paste it in right there. Check that you consent. So there are two options here, video verification and email. Video verification is a little bit more involved. I generally try the email verification first. If I'm going to, after I submit this, receive a response from Google via email, and they'll let me know if the information I've provided is not enough and that we need to hop on a live video call, we can do that. But I generally try email first. The website that's being used to represent the business online, in this case, I'm going to just copy and paste this directly. So the customer URL is right there. Um, would enter the phone number that is best for them to reach me on if they have any questions. And then it's asking for photos. So it's going to want some photos like these here of the lobby, the exterior of the business showing signage. It gives you descriptions of what you should include. So make sure you have those before you get into this. Um, and I'll have to upload these one at a time. If there's anything else you have besides photos you think is useful to include, you can upload those files here. My relationship to the business, I work for an agency um, that's associated with this business. That agency name is Blink Jar Media. I do not have a related case ID because this is the first time I'm going through this process. I've not filed any kind of case or ticket for this before, so leave that blank and then click Submit. And then within about one to two business days, Google My Business Support will email you and get give you the next steps. They, they'll either go ahead and verify for you or they'll give you next steps that you need to take in order to make that happen. So hope this helps.